you call up the line. So they get set. Loafer standing OK in barrier number one. In her rise, milling around. Ultimatum about to join them with Cool Star. Bold Bastille looked pretty relaxed to my eye over there. And Dancer for money as well, waiting her turn. So will we see a filly stake their claim towards the top of the markets for the Blue Diamond after Bodyguard was impressive in the previous? High Octane unlucky still there at the head of affairs, but... Uh, what will the Phillies show us here? Now, Koryanagi joins the line. Blake Shin flattered, standing pretty well. There's an attendant in with uh, her jockey, Jake Noonan. Cool Star is about to come forward with Ultimatum. Bold Bastille, Zara just keeping her away from the other runners. Dancer for money, just wanting to back away at a crucial stage. In her eyes, with Mickey D, will take an outside Ellie. So they continue to load as Cool Star goes in. This uh, race has given us two Blue Diamond winners in the last seven years, including Catchy. As Dancer for Money is now brought forward. <laughs> Superlicious standing well, along with Juviance. So they have to work here on Dancer for Money. To take a middle alley. They're encouraging her forward. Dancer for money currently $24. So she just wants to uh, dig the heels in at the moment. Dancer for money encouraged with the attendant's latching arms and she'll slowly walk into that middle store. So Dancer for money goes in. Bold Bastille waits her turn as in her eyes will be one of the last. Bold Bastille the favourite to take the middle alley. Exciting to see her in the first 200 metres. She's got so much toe. They're set to run. Field of 15. They are ready. Stand by. Gates cleared. And they're racing. And Bol Bastille from the middle broke away the best. From on the outside to be or not to be. And also driving up on the inside is Koryanagi. Two lengths to Loafer on the fence from Cool Star and Dancer for Money. They were followed by Superlicious trying to get closer to the fence from Broadhurst. And then Hayasugi. And also She Hung the Moon from Ultimatum and Flattered. Well back in the field, Juviance and also Matisse. And in her eyes is last. So it's the favourite, Bol Bastille, just in front of Tobias or not to be at the 600 metres. Koryanagi next the inside. They were followed by Dancer for Money Deeper from Cool Star, who's niggled at before the corner. Lofa, Superlicious, Hayasugi, She Hung the Moon, Ultimatum, Flattered, and then Broadhurst on the inside. So it's Bold Bastille around the turn. 300 metres to go. Clicked up by Zara. A length in front of To Be or Not To Be. Back along the inside. Koryanagi is looking for the gaps. Just about got it. Bold Bastille, they've got it. Koryanagi To Be or Not To Be, and Hayasugi Hayasugi on the outside, Koryanagi and Hayasugi, they're going to hit it together, and it's nearly a dead heat, a photo, Hayasugi or Koryanagi, they were followed by Matisse in company with To Be or Not To Be, who just misses the drum, I fancy, Ultimatum, Bol Bastille got tired, followed by Flattered, Superlicious in her eyes, Loafer next, and then came Broadhurst, well back, She Hung the Moon, in company with Juviance, and towards the back, Dancer for Money and Cool Star, it's a photo Koryanagi and Hayasugi, and it'll be Hayasugi, number two. Number two, Hayasugi's got up to win it by a nose. It's a wart on the line in a thriller. Their heads were in unison. The fun continues for Clinton McDonald and his team. Hayasugi, winner of the preview, winner of the prelude, the first to do it since Fontaton back in 2015.